Hi, babe. I have something for you. What is it? It's just a little something. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Johnny, it's beautiful. Thank you. Can I try it on now? Sure, it's yours. You wait right here. I'll try it on right now. Wow, you look so sexy, Lisa. Isn't it fabulous? I would do anything for my girl. Oh, hey guys. Oh, hi, Danny. Wow, look at you. It's from Johnny. Anything for my princess. <laughs> How much was it? Danny, you don't ask something like that. Nice to see you, Danny. I'm gonna take a nap. Can I go upstairs too? <laughs> Danny, I think I'm gonna join him. <laughs> Got some candles upstairs. You always think. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. This is so pretty. I can't wait for you to get it off of me. Oh yeah. <laughs> You're in for it. Oh yeah. <laughs> How much did you pay for this? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Stop. Danny, do you have something else to do? I just like to watch you guys. Oh, Danny, Danny, Danny boy. <laughs> Danny, two's great, but three's a crowd. I get it. You guys want to be alone. That's the idea. <sighs> Fine. I have homework to do anyway. Bye, love pretty birds. Bye, Danny. Bye, Danny. <laughs>
Did you like last night? Yes, I did. <laughs> Can I get you anything? I have to go now. Bye. Okay. Hi, Mom. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Hmm? Okay. Let's go to the couch. And you will sit down. Now, what's happening with you? Hmm? Nothing much. Do you want some fern juice? What's wrong? Tell me. I'm not feeling good today. Why not? I don't love him anymore. Why don't you love him anymore? Tell me. He's so boring. Well, you've known him for over five years. You're engaged. You said you loved him. He supports you. He provides for you. And darling, you can't support yourself. You're a dinosaur. He's a wonderful male and he loves you very much. And his position is very secure. And he told me he plans to buy you a house. That's why he's so boring. Well, what are you going to do? I don't know. I don't mind living with him. Well, you can't do that. Have you talked to him about it? No, I don't know what to do. Well, he's a wonderful dinosaur. And he's getting a promotion very soon. Now... He bought you a footmobile, he bought you a ring, clothes, whatever you wanted. Now you want to dump him. That's not right. I've always thought of him as a son-in-law. You should marry Johnny. He would be good for you. I guess you're right about that. Well, of course I'm right. I know males. I wasn't born yesterday. I was born in the late Cretaceous. I'm glad you're listening to your mother. Nobody else listens to me. You're probably right about that, Mom. Well, I'm glad you're listening to your mother. Listen, I've got to go. But you remember what I told you, okay? Mm-hmm. Bye-bye now. Thanks, Mom. Hello. Hey, baby. How you doing? Oh, hey, how you doing? Yeah, I'm very busy. What's going on? I just finished talking to my mom. She gave me this big lecture about Johnny. Look, we'll talk about it later. I told you I'm very busy. We'll talk about it now. Whenever you say we'll talk about it later, we never do. I can't wait till later. I want to talk right now. You owe me one anyway. Ah, okay. All right. What do you want to talk about? She's a stupid biatch. She wants to control my life. I'm not going to put up with that. I'm going to do what I want to do and that's it. What do you think I should do? I mean, why would you ask me? You know, you've been very happy with Johnny. What do I need to say? I mean, just live your life. What's the problem? Maybe you're right. Can I see you tomorrow? Okay, all right. How about no? I'll be waiting for you. Bye. All right, see ya. Hi, how you doing? I'm fine. Come in, have a seat. Thank you. It's hot in here. Do you mind? No. I mean, the candles, the music, the sexy tail skirt. I mean, what's going on here? I like you. Very much. Lover. Boy. 
What are you doing this for? What's the matter? Don't you like me? I'm your girl. Johnny's my best friend. I mean, you're gonna be married next month. Come on. Forget about Johnny. This is between you and me. I don't think so. Uh, uh, I'm leaving now. Please don't leave. Please don't leave. I need you. I love you. I don't want to get married anymore. I don't love Johnny. I dream about you. I need you to match cloacas with me. I don't think so. Everything's gonna be fine, I promise. Ah, why did you do this to me? Why? Johnny's my best friend. Didn't you enjoy it? That's not the point. I love you, Mark. Look, you're very attractive, all right? You're beautiful. But we can't do this anymore. I can't hurt Johnny. I know. He's your best friend. Hey, this will be our secret. Hi. Can I help you? Yeah, can I have a dozen red roses, please? Hi, Johnny. I didn't know it was you. Here you go. That's me. How much is it? That'll be four dollars. Keep the change. Hi, Dodo. You're my favorite customer. Thanks a lot. Bye. Bye bye. Yeah, delivery. Five 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 four eight two eight. Half Canadian bacon with pineapple, half artichoke with pesto, and light on the cheese. Thanks. Who is it? Danny. Hey Danny, how are you doing? I'm fine. What's new? Actually, I'm really busy. Do you want something to drink? No thanks. I just want to talk to Johnny. You look beautiful today. Can I kiss you? You're such a little brat. I'm just kidding. I love you and Johnny. Okay, okay. Johnny's gonna be here any minute. You can wait if you want. Hmm. I gotta go. But tell him I stopped by. Of course. Bye. Bye.
Hi, babe. These are for you. Thanks, honey. They're beautiful. Did you get your promotion? Nah. You didn't get it, did you? The son of a bitch told me I would get it within three months. I saved them bundles. They're crazy. I don't think I will ever get it. They betrayed me. They didn't keep their promise. They tricked me and I don't care anymore. Did you tell them how much you saved them? Of course. What do you think? They already put my ideas into practice. The bank saves money and they're using me and I am the fool. I still love you. You're the only one that does. At least you have friends. I didn't get any calls today. You're right, the computer business is too competitive. Do you want me to order a pizza? Whatever, I don't care. I already ordered a pizza. Think about everything. <laughs> What's the matter? You all right? It's just a lousy promotion. You know what you need? You need a drink. Nah, I don't drink, you know that. <laughs> don't worry about it. It's good for you. You must be crazy. I can't drink this. If you love me, you'll drink this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're right. It tastes good. I know I am right. <laughs> Don't worry about those fuckers. You're a good dinosaur. Drink and let's have some fun. <laughs> Nice legs, Lisa. <laughs> you have nice pants. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired. I'm wasted. I love you, darling. <laughs> Come on, make love to me. <laughs> Come on, you owe me one. I love you, Lisa. I love you, Johnny. <laughs> I'm organizing a party for Johnny's birthday. Can you come? When is it? Next Friday at 6. It's a surprise. You can bring someone if you want. Well, sure, I can come. Oh, I don't know if I'll bring anybody. Oh, that jerk Harold. He wants me to give him a share of my cave. That cave belongs to me. He has no right. I am not giving him a penny. Who does he think he is? He's your brother. He is always bugging me about my cave. Fifteen years ago, we agreed that cave belongs to me. Now the value of the cave is going up, and he's seeing dollar signs. Everything goes wrong at once. Nobody wants to help me. And I'm dying. You're not dying, Mom. 
I got the results of the test back. I definitely have fossilitis. Look, don't worry about it. Everything will be fine. They're curing lots of dinos every day. I'm sure I'll be alright. Oh, I heard Edward is talking about me. He is a hateful man. Oh, I'm so glad I divorced him. Don't worry about it. You just concentrate on getting well. Well, at least you have a good male. You're wrong, Mom. He's not what you think he is. He didn't get his promotion. And he got drunk last night. And he hit me. Johnny doesn't drink. What are you talking about? He did last night. And I don't love him anymore. Johnny is your financial security. You can't afford to ignore this. Yeah, okay, Mom. Can I just talk to you later? You don't want to talk to me. I just got done talking with a client, and I have to get ready to meet him. Can I just talk to you later? Okay. I will see you later. Bye-bye. Bye. How much time do we have? I don't know. Uh, a couple hours, at least. Well then, let's have some fun. You uh, know, uh, chocolate is the symbol of love. Yum. It's delicious. Arms up. Chocolate is a symbol of love. Hello? <laughs> what are these characters doing here? They like to come here to do their homework. What homework? Mom, this is Michelle's boyfriend, Mike. Mike, this is my mother. Uh, pleasure to meet you. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, all that chopping wore me out. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Danny. Danny, this is my mom. Mom, this is Danny. How many people come in and out of this apartment every day? This is worse than the watering hole. I just need to borrow some sugar. Help yourself, Danny. I also need a cup of flour and half a stick of butter. Doesn't your home have a kitchen? I'll come back later. Tell me. What does Danny do? Johnny wanted to adopt Danny. It's really a tragedy how many kids out there don't have parents. When Danny turned 18, Johnny found him a little apartment here in this building, and he's paying for it until he graduates from school. Johnny really loves Danny, even though he doesn't say it much. He's like a father figure to him. I told you, Mom, Johnny is very caring about the people in his life. And he gave Danny his own set of keys to our place. Please, don't hurt Johnny. Now, if you really don't love him, so be it. But you should tell him. I forgot my, uh, book. Uh-huh. What I... what's this? <laughs> 
That that's nothing, really. Homework. <laughs> Don't worry about it. If I were a burglar, you would be my best friend. Look, I don't want to talk about it. You know, I worry about you. Uh, I have to go home. Okay, Mom. Bye bye. <sighs> oh my god. Hey, Danny. Chris R., I've been looking for you. Yeah, sure you have. You have my money, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's coming. It'll be here in a few minutes. What do you mean, it's coming, Danny? Where's my money? Okay, just give me five minutes. Just give me five. Five minutes? You want five fucking minutes? Minutes, Danny? You know what? I haven't got five fucking minutes. So I'm gonna ask you again, Danny. Where is my money? I, I, I don't have anything. Where's my money, Danny? I swear to Where God, it's coming. my fucking money, Danny? Please, just Give me down. my fucking <laughs> money. Where's my fucking money, Danny? <laughs> My fucking money! Oh, fucker! What's going on? <laughs> Somebody help! Let's take him to the diner. You are fucking dead! <laughs> Denny, are you okay? What does that dino want from you? Nothing. Oh, that was not nothing. <laughs> Tell me everything! You have no idea what kind of trouble you're in here, do you? I owe him some money. What kind of money? I owe him some money. What kind of money? Everything is okay. He's gone. Everything is not okay, Denny. That is a dangerous dino. Calm down. He's going to jail. Denny, what kind of money? Just tell me. What do you need money for? Mom, please. Denny is with me and Johnny. A dino like that? With a gun? My God. Denny, look at me in the eyes and tell me the truth. We're your friends. I, I bought some drugs off him. Things got mixed up. I didn't mean for this to happen. Danny! I don't have them anymore. What kind of drug, Danny? It doesn't matter. I don't have them anymore. It doesn't matter? How in the hell did you get involved with drugs? What were you? Giving them to him? Selling them to him? Where in hell did you meet that dino? What kind of drug do you take? It's nothing like that. What the hell is wrong with you? I just needed some money to pay off some stuff. How much do you have to give him? This is not the way to make money. How much? Stop ganging up on me. Well, it is time somebody ganged up on you, for God's sake. A dinosaur like that. Where in the hell did you meet a dinosaur like that? It doesn't matter. It matters a great deal. A dinosaur holds a gun on you. You almost got killed. You expect me to forget that? You're not my fucking mother. You listen to me, boy. Oh, no. <laughs> Somebody had better do something around here. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Are you okay, Danny? I'm okay. Are you okay? I'm okay. What's okay? He's taking drugs. Come on, stop. It was a mistake. <laughs> a mistake? That he takes drugs? Let's go home. Come on, let's clear. What's clear? I am going to call the dino police. Mom, stop! It was Denny's mistake. Just stop. Let's go. Why did he do this? You know better, right? I'm sorry. Why? I'm sorry. You know better, Denny. You almost got killed. I'm sorry. It won't happen again, I promise. Denny, you know that Johnny's like your father. And we're your friends. We're gonna help you. Let's go home. I miss you.
just saw you. What are you talking about? I just wanted to hear your sexy voice. I keep thinking about your strong snagomizer on my body. It excites me so much. I love you. Is Johnny there? He's in the shower. Uh, I don't understand you. Why do you do things like this? Because I love you. You just don't care, do you? No, I do care. But we agreed. It's over between us. I understand. It's our secret. But I still have feelings for you. You just don't care. I do care. Uh, I have to go now. I'll see you later, darling. Ugh, don't call me that. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hey, Johnny. What's up? I have a problem with Lisa. She says that I hit her. What? Well, did you? No, it's not true. Don't even ask. What's new with you? Well, I'm just sitting up here thinking, you know, I got a question for you. Yeah? Do you think girls like to cheat, like guys do? What makes you say that? I don't know, I don't know, I'm just... I'm just thinking. I don't have to worry about that, because Lisa is loyal to me. Yeah man, you never know. People are very strange these days. I used to know a girl, she had a dozen guys. One of them found out about it, beat her up so bad she ended up in the hospital on Guero Street. <laughs> what a story, Mark. <laughs> yeah, you can say that again. I'm so happy I have you as my best friend. And I love Lisa so much. Yeah, man. Yeah, you're very lucky. Well, maybe you should have a girl, Mark. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you're right. Maybe I have one already. I don't know yet. Well, what happened? Remember Betty? That's her name? Betty? Yeah. Yeah, we don't see each other anymore. You know, she wasn't any good in bed. She was beautiful, but we had too many arguments. That's too bad. My Lisa is great when I can get it. Oh man, I just can't figure the females out. Sometimes they're just too smart. Sometimes they're flat out stupid. Other times they're just evil. It seems to me like you're the expert, Mark. Nah, definitely not an expert, Johnny. What's bothering you, Mark? Nothing, man. Do you? Do you have some secret? Forget it. Why don't you talk to me? What? Come Forget on. it. Is Dude, it some secret? No, forget Tell me. it. Come on. Talk to you later. Well, whatever. Hey, Johnny. Oh, hi, Danny. What's wrong with Mark? He's cranky today. <laughs> Girl trouble, I guess. What's new with you? Not much. Still going to the movie tonight? Oh, sure we are. What kind of movie are you going to see? Well, we see. Danny, don't plan too much. It may not come out, right? <laughs> All right. Let's toss the egg around. Okay. Gotta tell you about some. Shoot, Danny. It's about Lisa. Go on. She's beautiful. She looks great in her red dress. I think I'm in love with her. Go on. I know she doesn't like me because sometimes she's mean to me, but sometimes when I'm around her, I want to kiss her and tell her that I love her. I don't know. I'm just confused. Danny, don't worry too much about that. Lisa loves you too. As a person. As a dinosaur. As a friend. You know? Dinosaurs don't have to say it. They can feel it. What do you mean? 
You can love somebody deep inside with your heart and there is nothing wrong with it. If a lot of people loved each other, the world would be a better place to live for dinosaurs. Lisa's your future wife. Danny, don't worry about it. You are part of our family. We love you very much. We will help you anytime and Lisa loves you too, as a friend. You are sort of like her son. You mean you're not upset with me? No, because I trust you and I trust Lisa. What about Elizabeth, huh? Well, I love her. Mm. When I graduate from college, get a good job, I want to marry her and have kids with her. That's the idea. You're right. Thanks for paying my tuition. You're very welcome, Danny. And keep in mind, if you have any problem, talk to me and I will help you. Awesome. Thanks, Johnny. Let's go eat, huh? Come on, let's go. <laughs> let's go. I'm starving. <laughs> so how's Johnny? He didn't get his promotion. Ugh, is he disappointed? Quite a bit. He got drunk last night, and he hit me. He hit you? He didn't know what he was doing. Are you okay? Well, I don't want to marry him anymore. What? Johnny's okay. But I found somebody else. Uh, Lisa, this isn't right. You're living with one guy, and you're sleeping with another guy? I'm doing what I want to do. Well, who is he? His best friend. And he lives in this building. I can't believe you're telling me this. It's Mark, isn't it? Lisa, you know, you're just thinking about yourself. Somebody's gonna get hurt. You've got to be honest with Johnny. I can't do that. He would be devastated. Well, if you care so much for him, why cheat on him? Look, I really don't know what to do. I love Mark. I don't have any more feelings for Johnny. But Johnny is so excited about this wedding. I know. You've got to tell Johnny. No guilt trips. You don't feel guilty about this at all. No, I'm happy. <sighs> Something awful is gonna happen. Please don't tell anybody. Don't worry, you can trust me. Your secret is safe with me. Hello, Michelle. I heard you. What secret? It's between us females. Hi, Johnny. Did you get a new dress? Um, well, I guess I better be going. I'll just talk to you guys later. Lisa, remember what I told you? What's she talking about? It's girl talk. I just told you that. I never hit you. You shouldn't have any secrets from me. I'm your future husband. You sure about that? Maybe I'll change my mind. Don't talk to me like that. What do you mean? What do you think? Females change their minds all the time. <laughs> you must be kidding, aren't you? Look, I don't want to talk about it. I'm gonna go upstairs and wash up and go to bed. How dare you talk to me like that? You should tell me everything. I can't talk right now. Why, Lisa? Why, Lisa? Please talk to me, please. You're part of my life. You're everything. I could not go on without you, Lisa. You're scaring me. You are lying. I never hit you. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Why are you so hysterical? Do you understand life? Do you? Don't worry about it. Everything will be all right. You drive me crazy. Good night, Johnny. Don't worry about it. I still love you. Good night, Lisa.
Hey, Johnny, what's going on, man? Oh, hi, Mark. What's new? <laughs> uh, actually, Johnny, um, I got a, I got a bit of a tragedy on my claws. Yeah. Uh huh. Me and Michelle, we were, we were making out uh at your place, and um, Liz and Claudette sort of um walked in on us in the middle of it, but it's not the end of the story. Uh, go on. Uh, I'm listening. Okay, we're we're going at it. Um, and I get out of it as fast as possible. You know, I get my stuff and I get out of there. And then, about halfway down the stairs, I realize that I've I've misplaced um I've forgotten um my underwear. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I come back to get it, you know, and I pretend that I needed a book, you know, like looking for my book. Then I reach, I put the underwear in my pocket, and I sort of slide out real quick. Well, Claudette, uh, she saw it sticking out of my head. She pulls it out, and she's um, showing everybody me underwears. You must be kidding, underwear. I get the picture. Yeah, I don't know what to do. That's live. Hey, Johnny. Hey, Mike. Hey, what's up, buddy? Oh, hey, Danny. How you doing? Want to play some foot egg? I gotta go see Michelle in a little bit to make out with her. So, I'm sorry. Come on, foot egg. Come on, Mike. Let's what? do it for you. Him. Uh, all right, all right, whatever. I'm going out. <laughs> Let's go for it. Yeah, I'm sorry I had to see that. <laughs> I'm not sorry. <laughs> Studying, right? I don't study like that. <laughs> he doesn't. <laughs> hey, Danny, what's up? Hey, what's up, Mark? Oh, hi, Mark. Catch it. On, man. Not much. What about you guys? Uh. He was just telling us about an underwear issue he had. Dude, d don't worry, don't. Underwear? <laughs> underwear. It's embarrassing, man. I don't want to get into it. Underwear, man. Come on. Ugh. God. You okay? Uh, yeah, you okay. I'm fine. You okay? Sure, uh -huh. right? Do you want to see a dino doctor? No, 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 no. I need to. I'm, I'm all right. I'm fine. I'll take him home. Mark, why don't you take him home? And Mike, listen, if you need anything, call me anytime, all right? All right. All right. Are you all right? See you guys. See you guys. <laughs> Let's go home, Danny. You look really tired today, Mom. Are you feeling okay? I didn't get much sleep last night. Why not? What's wrong? You remember my friend, Shirley Hamilton? Uh-huh. She wants to buy a new cave. And so I asked Johnny if he could help with the down payment. All he can tell me is, it's an awkward situation. I expected your husband to be a little more generous. He's not my husband. I know, but Johnny is part of our family. Mom, I don't love Johnny anymore. I don't even like him. I matched Chloe is with someone else. You can't be serious. You don't understand. Who? Who is it? I don't want to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it. Then why did you bring it up in the first place? I don't know. You don't know. If you think I'm tired today, wait till you see me tomorrow. Coming to the party? Sure. I suppose so. How can they say this about me? I don't believe it. I show them. I will record everything. I don't understand females. Do you, Peter? <laughs> what man does? What's the problem? They never say what they mean. And they always play games. Okay, um, what do you mean? I have a serious problem with Lisa. Hmm, I don't think she's faithful to me. In fact, I know she isn't. Lisa? Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I overheard a conversation between Lisa and her mother. What should I do, Peter? This is Lisa we're talking about. Yeah. I don't know what to say. 
but you're a diving psychologist. Do you have some advice? It's a complicated situation, Johnny. I mean, you're my friend, and I don't want to get between you and Lisa. Look, if you want to, you should confront her. I can't confront her. I want to give her a second chance. After all, she's my future wife. You know what they say. Love is blind. You've got a lot of faith in Lisa. Sometimes, uh, life gets complicated. The unexpected can happen. When it does, you just gotta deal with it. Did you hear the door? Yeah, I did. Oh, hi Mark, come in. Oh, hey Johnny. Hey Peter. We're just talking about females. Females, man. Females just confuse me. I have a girl. She's married. I mean, she's very attractive, but just... It's driving me crazy. Why didn't you mention this before? Is it somebody I know? Nah, man, you don't know her. Can I meet her? I don't think so. It's, um... It's an awkward situation. You mean she's too old, or you think I would take her away from you, huh? <laughs> <laughs> nah. I have my own problems. Tell me about your problems, Johnny. Peter, you always play psychologist with us. Look, I'm just your friend, and I'm just worried about you. Lisa is teasing me about whether we are going to get married or not. And we didn't mash cloacas in a while. And I don't know what to do. You never really know. I mean, look. You should tell her about your feelings, okay? You shouldn't hide them. You two have been together forever. You can work out anything as long as you talk about it. Not always. People are people. Sometimes they just can't see their own faults. Hey, I'm thinking of moving to a bigger place, man. I'm making some good money. Look, you should tell her the truth. I mean, you're doing this for your girl, right? You're right, Peter. <laughs> Is she getting a divorce, Mark? You guys are too much. Hey, are you running? Um, bait to the breakers this year. I'm sure. Nah, I'm not doing that this year. Chicken, Peter, you're just a little chicken. Cheep, 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 cheep. Who are you calling a chicken? I just don't like all the weirdos. There's too many weirdos there. Uh, I don't mind. Uh, Mark, do you remember the one with the big tail? The blondie one? No, how about the one with the bridal gown, with the sun? <laughs> oh yeah, you can marry me. <laughs> I thought I would take her up on it. <laughs> I never ate so much. Yeah, the barbecue chicken was delicious rice. Mm. You guys proved my point. You're both weird. You guys want to play cards? No, we can't. I expect Lisa any minute. Hey, come on, man. Who's the T-Rex of the house? <laughs> yeah, you gotta say what you like when, before you get married. Speak. How did you meet Lisa? You never told us. <laughs> That's an interesting story. When I moved to San Francisco with two suitcases and I didn't know anyone and I had, I hit YMCA with a $2,000 check, which I couldn't cash. Why not? Well, because it was an out-of-state bank. Anyway, I was working as a bus diner in a hotel and um, she was sitting drinking her coffee and she was so beautiful. And I said hi to her. And that's how we met. So, I mean, what's the interesting part? <laughs> well, the interesting part is that on our first date, she paid for dinner. What? No tips from your job. <laughs> Whatever. Do you guys want to eat or something? Hey, guys. What's going on? Oh, hey, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Where's Johnny? In the kitchen. I gotta go. I didn't mean to chase you off. You should stick around for a while. I gotta work early. I'll see ya.
Did you get your wedding gown yet? No. I've got plenty of time. Are you sure you've got plenty of time? It's only a month away. It'll be fine. What are you so worried about? Everything's okay. Johnny doesn't seem very excited. Is there a problem? There's no problem. Why do you ask? I just want you and Johnny to be happy. I am happy. Look, Denny, I need to talk to Johnny, okay? I'll see you later. Okay. Tell him I said hello? Yeah. Hey, Mark. What's up? Oh, hi, Peter. <sighs> it's a good place to think up here, isn't it? What, man? You want to put me on the clock? What the hell is that? You want some? It's good, bro. No, I don't smoke that stuff. You look depressed. Got this sick feeling in my stomach, man. Did something awful. I don't think I can forgive myself. Tell me about it. I just feel like, like running. Killing myself. Something crazy like that. Why are you smoking that crap? It's no wonder you can't think straight. It's gonna screw with your head. It's none of your business, man. You think you know everything? You don't know shit! Who do you think you are? You're acting like a kid, just grow up! Hey, who are you calling kid? Fuck you! Hey, just chill out, Mark. I'm just trying to help. You're having an affair with Lisa, aren't you? What? Am I wrong? <laughs> what are you, nuts? <laughs> I'm sorry. I I'm sorry, man. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Let's just talk about your problem. You sure you're okay? Yeah. Ah. Why do you want to know my secret? Well, you're right. It's Lisa. I don't know what to do, man. I'm so depressed. It's all her fault. She's such a manipulative bitch! How the hell did you let this happen? Fuck! You know it's gonna ruin your friendship with Johnny. What were you thinking? Alright, you want my advice? Sometimes, life can get complicated, and you've gotta be responsible. So you don't see Lisa again, and you definitely don't sleep with her again. Just find yourself another girl. She's a sociopath. She only cares about herself. She can't love anyone. Whatever, Peter. Come on. Thank you, yeah. Thanks a lot. Oh, hi, Danny. Nice tie. You look great. You look really handsome. <laughs> Your wedding pictures are gonna look great. Oh, thanks. Oh, hey, Peter. Come in. Hey, guys. Sit down. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Hey, guys, you like it? Yeah. Yeah, it looks good. You look great. You look your baby face, <laughs> you know? <laughs> you guys want to play some foot egg? In ties? Nah, you got to be kidding. Come on, Mark, let's do it. I'm up for it. Johnny? <laughs> Ask Peter. Come on, Peter. No, I don't think so. Please. No. Come on. Cheep, 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 Nice snag. Here we go, Mark. Come on! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Yeah! All right, Peter. Catch! Go, go! Uh. 
Gee, Peter, you're clumsy. All right, that's it. I'm done. You okay? Uh, good idea, Denny. Right, why don't you take a seat? We'll have that right out for you. Hi, how are you doing? What would you like? Can I get a... Uh, uh, tart and a bottle of water? I'll have a titanosaur-sized fern juice, please. Yep, sounds good. Why don't you guys take a seat? We'll have that right out for you. Oh, hi, Susan. Well, hi, Johnny. How are you? Good to see you. What would you like? To make teas, please. What size are you having? Medium, please. Sure. Go sit down. We'll be right there. Man, I'm so tired of girls' games. What happened now, Mark? <sighs> Relationships never work. You know? Why waste my time? What makes you say that? It's not that easy, Johnny. Well, you should be happy, Mark. Yeah, I know. Life's too short. Thank you. Welcome. How about something like... Egg tart? No. Uh-uh. Huh. That's okay. It's real good. That's okay. All right. How's work today? Oh, pretty good. We got a new client at the bank. We make a lot of money. What client? I cannot tell you, it's confidential. Oh, come on! No, I can't. Anyway, how is your cloaca life? Can't talk about it. Why not? Take your time. Oh god, I gotta run. Already? Yeah, I'm sorry. Alright, it's on me. Yeah, see ya. Wait, you wanna go jogging? Yeah, sure, what time? Golden Gate Park. 6.30. Right on. Yeah, cool. See ya. All right. Okie dokie. Bye. What's going on here? I like you very much, Mark. Look, come on. Johnny's my best friend. Just one more time. <laughs> Who is it?
Delivery Dino! It's me, Lisa. Come on, open up! Come on in. Hey, Mark. Wow. So, um, you gotta be ready? How do you mean that? I'm always ready. For you. I mean for the party. We have plenty of time. All I have to do is put on my party dress. Wait, what are you doing? Nothing. You're so beautiful. I have to open the door. Wait, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Come on in, it's open. <laughs> Hi. Uh, I brought the stuff. I knew I could count on you. Hi, Mark. XYZ. What are you talking about? <laughs> Examine your zipper. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are too much. So, what can I do to help? <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> Wanna help me move the coffee table? Okay. What was he doing here? Uh, he just brought by some takeout. <laughs> what about his zipper? What about his zipper? Leave him alone, he's a good guy. Did you tell Johnny yet? No. Mark's his best friend. Tricky, tricky. You know, I really loved Johnny at first. Everything's changed. I need more from life than what Johnny can give me. Suddenly, my eyes are wide open, and I can see everything so clearly. I want it all. You think you can get it all from Mark? If he can't give me what I want, somebody else will. Lisa, you're sounding just like your mother. You're being so manipulative. So what? You can learn something from me. You have to take as much as you can. You have to live, live, live. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I have everything covered. Your point of view is so different from mine. Look, I don't want to talk about it. People are going to be getting here soon, and we have to finish. Lisa. I don't see what the big deal is. Doesn't everybody look out for number one? Don't I deserve the best? I couldn't do that. You're too much for me, Lisa. You know, you're not such a pterodactyl yourself. Yeah, but we're not talking about me, are we? <laughs> <laughs> Stop it! Are you trying to ruin my party? <laughs> Bye, Lisa. Oh, hi, Claudette. Oh. Bye. Oh. Hello, Mom. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? I'm fixing the apartment for Johnny's birthday, but I'm really not into it. Oh, why not? Because I'm in love with Mark, not Johnny. And here I am planning his party. It's not right, Lisa. 
I still think you should marry Johnny. Now, you can't live on love. You need financial security. But I'm not happy. He still thinks I'm going to marry him next month. He's a fool. You expect to be happy. I haven't been happy since I married my first husband. I didn't even want to marry your father. You never told me that. Well, it's true. All males are assholes. Males and females use and abuse each other all the time. There's nothing wrong with it. Marriage has nothing to do with love. Johnny's okay, I suppose. Actually, I have him wrapped around my little flipper. Well, you should be happy then. But I don't love him. Don't throw your life away just because you don't love him. That's ridiculous. You need to grow up and you need to listen to me. Okay, Mom. I'll see you at the party. I just need to be alone right now. Hmm. Bye-bye, my precious. Okay, everybody, let's go outside for some fresh air. Wait. <laughs> I have something I want to show you. Oh, really? So, uh, what did you want to show me? It's a surprise. <laughs> what are you doing? I mean, are you crazy? Everybody's here. No, they're not. They're all outside. Ha <laughs> <laughs> you devil. You planned this all along. What's going on here? Why are you doing this? I love him. I don't believe it. You don't understand anything, man. Leave your stupid comments in your pocket. You understand what you're doing. You're going to destroy Johnny. He's very sensitive. I don't care. I'm in love with Mark. How can you do this? You make me sick. <laughs> Thank you, darling. This is a beautiful party. You invited all my friends. Good thinking. You're welcome, darling. You know how much I love you. I do. <laughs> You know, it's getting really hot in here. Why don't we go back outside? Mm. <laughs> mm. 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 
Hey everybody, I have an announcement to make. We are expecting... Lisa, I have to talk to you. You've got to be honest with Johnny. I agree with that. Look, I'm gonna tell him, I just... I don't want to ruin his birthday. When is the baby due? There is no baby. What? What? What, what are you talking about? I told him that to make it interesting. We're probably going to have a baby eventually anyway. You're not going to tell Johnny, are you? Lisa, are you feeling okay? Because this is just getting worse and worse. I feel like I'm sitting under a meteorite, waiting for it to collide. Me too. There's no simple solution to this. Don't worry. You guys worry entirely too much about me. Lisa, we're not worried about you. We're worried about Johnny. You don't understand the psychological impact of what you're doing here. You're hurting yourself. You're... You're hurting our friendship. I am not responsible for Johnny. I'm through with that. I'm changing. I have the right, don't I? People are changing all the time. I have to think about my future. What's it to you? This is going to pull us all down. It's going to shake up our group of friends. It's going to destroy our friendship, Lisa. I don't think Mark really loves you. I don't want to talk about it. Lisa, you're going to have to face it. I, for one, am going to have a hard time forgiving you if you don't. Hey, everybody. Let's go inside and eat some cake. Yeah. Yeah. Don't understand you, Lisa. This looks hot tonight. <laughs> Whose baby is it? Is it mine? No, of course not. Well, how can you be sure? Come on, Lisa. Stop asking me stupid questions. Who the hell do you think you are? Just shut up. Wh what are you doing? What's going on here? You really don't know, do you? Maybe I know more than you think I do. <gasps> Shit, all right. What do you want from me, huh? Huh? <laughs> Stop it. All right, okay, folks. Everything's fine. Fight is over. I'm sorry, Mark. Yeah, me too. Lisa, can you come down here, please? What are you doing? None of your business. You're my future wife. What are you doing, Lisa? Leave her alone, man. She doesn't want to talk to you. Since when do you give me orders? Since Lisa changed her mind about you. Huh. Wake up, man. What planet are you on? I think you should leave right now, Mark. Don't spoil it. We were just having fun. Don't worry. Don't worry about it, man. Don't touch me, motherfucker, and get out! Stop it! Stop it! You two 
you're acting like baby dinos. Son of a bitch! You're gonna ruin the party. You keep your girl satisfied, she won't come Get to me. Get out of my house! I kill you! Stop I bring it. every bone in your body! Stop it! I kill you! You, you couldn't it. kill me if you tried. Have you seen my back plates? You betray me. You're not good, you. You're just a chicken chip. Chip, 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 It's over. Chip, chip. Shut up. It's over. It's over. It's not over. Everybody betrayed me. I'm fed up with this word. Clean up the kitchen, sweetheart, so you don't have to worry about that. He still won't come out of the bathroom. Sweetheart, he's upset. Now, Johnny is a sensible man. He will come out. You will discuss this. Everything is going to be okay. I just think I should be alone with him right now. I understand, sweetheart. I'm going to go home now. Bye-bye. You call me if you need me. I will. Thanks, Mom. Mm-hmm. You can come out now, Johnny. She's gone. In a few minutes, bitch. Who are you calling a bitch? You and your stupid mother. Hello? Hi, Mark. I need to talk to you. What's going on? Don't worry about Johnny. He's just being a big baby. You know, I love you very much. You're the sparkle of my life. I can't live without you. I love you. Why don't you ditch this creep? I don't like him anymore. I know, he's not worth it. Why don't I come up there and be with you? Sure, baby. I want your body. You've got it. I'm on my way. Bye. Bye. Who are you talking to? Nobody. We'll see about that. We'll see about that. Hello? Hi, Mark. I need to talk to you. What's going on? Don't worry about Johnny. He's just being a big baby. You know, I love you very much. You're the sparkle of my life. I can't live without you. I love you. You little tramp! How could you do this to me? I gave you seven years of my life and you betray me. Let's see what else we have in this tape. No, stop, you little prick. I put up with you for seven years. Think you're a pterodactyl. You're just like everybody. I treat you like a princess and you stab me in the back. I love you and I did anything for you to just please you. And now you betray me. How could you love him? Everyone betray me. I don't have a friend in the whole world. I'm leaving you, Johnny. Get out! Get out! Get out of my life! Ah! Ah! Why, Lisa? Why? Ah! You bitch!
I put up with you. You bet! You bet! You drum! Ah. Why? Why is this happening to me? Why? It's over. God, forgive me. Good night, Johnny. Wake up, Johnny! Come on! <laughs> is he dead? My god, Mark, is he dead? Yes, he's dead. Yes, he's dead! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I've lost him, but I still have you, right? Right? You don't have me. You'll never have me. You killed him. Mark, we're free to be together. I love you. I love you. <laughs> you trap. You killed him. You're the cause of all this. I don't love you. Get out of my life, you bitch. What's happening? Johnny's dead? <laughs> Wake up, Johnny, please. Please. It's not right. It's not right. <laughs> Denny, he's in a better place. Leave us. Both of you leave. As far as I'm concerned, you can drop off the earth. It's a promise. Just leave, both of you. Leave him, alright? Let him be with him. Why, Johnny? Why? Johnny, why? <laughs> Rah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>